Here's Chief Meteorologist Gannon Medwick with your first alert forecast. And your forecast is first at 643. Everything's on the up today. Temperatures, winds, some gusts over 30 miles an hour probable as soon as by lunchtime, certainly into the afternoon and evening. And those blustery winds whisk through a pretty potent line of showers and storms. When it's done, it's done. We're brisk tomorrow but brighter as well as cooler. That's your Thursday forecast. Let's take you through some of this with your cloud and future radar model for the Cape Fear region and our broader Carolina region will start arbitrarily a little later this morning at 9 a.m. You know, it's some clouds locally, but not so many raindrops. Those are to the west forward to 3 p.m. Some of those showers and embedded storms knocking on the door and or moving in and they continue through drive time into a portion of the evening. If the lowest layers of our atmosphere can warm up enough, it'll be a game of inches. We could get some severe rated thunderstorms to mix into this situation. A narrow window, a couple hours either side of sunset, but enough to stay alert for. Blustery and wet in any case, and then not so much on the wet part overnight tonight and in the first thing tomorrow. The radar is clean here for Carolina in the morning Thursday and to the west. A few residual clouds try to hop over the mountains. There'll be some snowflakes in the mountains with cooler air, but we're completely dry in our corner of Carolina tomorrow. Let's get back to the here and now with the conversation and with a look outside with your David and Associates first alert sky cam from brightening Belleville on the Riverwalk looking over toward the uh, state port. Belleville, one of many locations where temperatures are rising pretty fast this morning. Couple of fleeting 30s in the corners, but most places having temperatures rising through the 40s and the 50s. And for now, winds are pedestrian, but it's not going to be very long after sunrise that those southerlies really crank up in intensity. Aforementioned gusts higher than 30 miles an hour may have you inspired to secure some loose items on your porch before you leave home base today. Radar scan pretty clean across the lower Cape Fear region, but not too far to the west. That line of showers and storms shows out. Let me finish up with your saltwater boards before your seven day. You get sandblasted on the beach today. Those southerly winds, no slouch. Cool ocean temps in the lower and middle 50s. Upcoming high tides on your screen include one in the 10 o'clock hour of this morning for east and south facing beaches and the National Weather Service not messing around as far as the narrative for the offshore waters. A gale warning going into effect for a good portion of today. Good one to stay in port. Here's your seven day planning forecast. Another spike in rain chances toward the end and then a whole lot of dry and seasonably cool weather in the middle. Bill, today's a hurdle to get over and we want to be with you every step of the way with your WECT weather app. Back to you.